My name is Nagda Riz. I am a professor of economics and founding director of the Access to Knowledge for Development Center at the American University in Cairo School of Business. My take on AI and inclusion comes from the stance that we need neither to romanticize nor demonize the technologies, but rather uh, democratize and harness for the betterment of human lives. So I bring a voice uh, of the South, from the South, to this uh, debate. I think the discourse should be uh, inclusive. The of course itself should be inclusive to look at how these technologies from the sense of use of the technologies and the production of technologies and in that sense we need to think of how we can uh, uh, devise business models that actually engage players from different parts of the world and that uh, lead to the openness of knowledge from a paradigm of openness from a paradigm of uh, engagement and sharing. It's very important to realize that the debates regarding AI and inclusion are not entirely new. They're quite similar to the uh, issues that, are, that came about with the digital technologies, the internet, looking at the potential of bringing uh, development, but at the same time, the opposite argument of uh, how the digital divide is actually exacerbated by uh, these new technologies. A key, a key area that needs to be uh, tackled is actually context-based research. For example, the future of work in the global north as opposed to other areas when there is informal labor. For, what does AI mean for uh, the type of jobs and the type of tasks that are uh, taking place? Another area is business models. What business models are appropriate for um, uh, the development of AI-based models, production and use? What, uh, what is the concept of value? Uh, what is the concept of in what intellectual property models, patent pools, knowledge sharing, data commons, all of these issues, there has to be a conversation to inform the discourse. The discourse itself has to be inclusive.